This video is sponsored by me. Links down below to the new song if you want to support it, and my Twitch if you want to come watch. Have fun. Super Mario Bros. released September 13th, 1985. Five years before I was even born. So in the year 2020, when Mario turned 35, Nintendo Yahoo! celebrated with a 16 minute long Whoa. Super Mario Bros. 35th anniversary direct, yeah! filled with cool new Mario releases and surprises. Keychains. Of course, Nintendo fans around the world immediately became excited as they remembered that Nintendo's other flagship franchise, Earthbound, I mean Zelda, was originally released in 1986 on February. February 21st, making 2021 Zelda's 35th anniversary. What fun new surprises did Nintendo have in store to mark this historic occasion? <laughs> Nothing? What? On the 17th, we had a 50 minute regular direct that was fine. Worms everywhere. And tucked away at the end was Skyward Sword HD coming to the Switch, which to be fair, I was pretty hyped for. This Legend of Zelda game will be coming to Nintendo Switch. Skyward Sword! It's going on! But there was not even so much of a mention of Zelda's 35th birthday. Where's Link, Princess? Why, right here, can't you see him? No. To make matters worse, as February, March, April, and May all melted away like the 35 candles on Mario's huge ass birthday cake, there was still no mention of our princess's party. Until June, when... This year, the original Legend of Zelda game reaches its 35th anniversary. While we don't have any campaigns or other Nintendo Switch games planned, and as if a million nerds cried out in terror, I was suddenly silenced. The dream of a Zelda 35th celebration was dead. You'll be dead! We've been working on this Game & Watch system as a special item to help mark the occasion and reflect fondly on the earliest days of The Legend of Zelda. So this Game & Watch is quite literally... It. <laughs> Zelda fans have been sat at home watching the metaphorical clock run out on their anniversary for the last five months, and now as a thank you, all they can do is quite literally just sit and watch the Zelda clock run out. I've seen people try and justify the lack of a Zelda birthday bash by pointing out what we did have smattered around here or there. Mario Game & Watch, Zelda Game & Watch. Mario Red Console, Zelda themed Joy-Cons. Mario 3D World, Skyward Sword HD. But I mean, come on, for starters, that last one doesn't even count. Because Mario 3D World came with a whole additional Bowser's Fury game. All Skyward Sword comes with is some actual decent controls, assuming you're not currently suffering from Joy-Con drift. Although I guess those new Zelda Joy-Cons will solve that for at least six months. Besides the fact that Zelda 35th wasn't even mentioned by Nintendo, and Mario had a whole 16 minute Yahoo! direct, let's tally up everything else. Mario fans also had a free Mario 35th game, Super Mario missions and rewards on Nintendo's website, 35th themed merchandise at the Nintendo New York store, a special made 35th course in Mario Maker 2, Smash Brothers Ultimate had an in-game tournament, a Mario themed Splatfest in Splatoon, keychains, Super Mario furniture in Animal Crossing, Mario dresses, Mario shoes, Mario Lego, Super Mario All-Stars came to the Switch online that day, Mario 3 D All-Stars with Mario 64, Sunshine, and Galaxy all on the Switch, not to mention another brand new Mario Kart game that even came with a real voice to like Mario Kart Luigi and Mario that was with alternate reality. Even the Mario Kart Mobile app celebrated with an in-game event, but sure. Zelda fans can look forward to more of this. Okay, you have to pay attention because the only way to defeat it is to cut it in the same direction that its mouth is open. <laughs> Doesn't work if you cut top to bottom on it. Maybe Bill's a little bit better at this point. Okay, so here. I have to cut vertically. I mean, we could have at least got some clothes. I would have settled for Zelda Crocs. Needless to say, Zelda got done dirty. So, I think it's up to us 
the fans, to celebrate and appreciate everything that Zelda has given us throughout the years. I can't think of any better way for me to celebrate Zelda than to look back at the history of Zelda through the eyes of decades gone marketing and weird commercials. I don't know if you guys have ever gone back and watched some of these old wacky Zelda commercials, but they're like something ripped out of a alternate universe. Thankfully, no one else has reacted to these trailers on YouTube before, so this will be the first. Hey, what are you doing? Hello? What are you doing? Uh, I'm about to react to old Zelda commercials. Oh yeah, interesting, huh? Cool. Uh, you know, you, you think maybe uh, somebody had uh, done that before at some point? You? Four years ago? Do, do you mind if I do it now? Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, okay. <laughs> Great, sorry, you had me worried there for a second. Peeps? Hey, pe oh, Peeps! You Me? Yeah! Oh, hey, yeah! Do you I was just, I was just wondering, did you want to be in the video? I mean, since you're already so experienced in reacting to Zelda commercials, I could use a hand. Oh, yeah, sure. I mean, I thought you'd never ask. Let's do it! <laughs> I'm actually waiting to see if there's a single one I haven't seen. Oh, I haven't seen this one. Never mind. I already are. We've already hit one. I haven't seen this one. You're welcome. What I love so much about old commercials is how much they feel like movies, like old 80s movies. They tried so hard with practical effects and like outfits and costumes. Yeah, I think that's one thing I miss is those old commercials where they do stuff like this. I mean, this commercial is so stupid. This is the good one. Who could fit? Forget the, hey, nice graphics. Whoa, nice graphics. I'd like to get my hands on that game. The Legend of Zelda and it's really rad. Those creatures from Ganon are pretty bad. Do you know the words? Yes. I love how back in these days, it was like, nice graphics graphics about these really old 8-bit consoles and now we have breath of the wild and people are like why is it not in 4k though <laughs> it kind of looks the same as the other game um, kind of looks like a baby's game oh god this one <laughs> zelda 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 where are you i don't know do they not know what the game is like or do they just think yeah, the game's not yes. interesting enough did they think that this is what the game was going to be like just some <laughs> link running around zelda Zelda, Zelda, Zelda. Just some guy in a dark room screaming Zelda. All right, dark room. Zelda, Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> this is better. Yeah, this is yeah. Here we go. This is more like it. Someone played the first game and were like, nah, nah, nah. This time. Oh, he has a sword. Well, that would have been nice to know. What? What did they say? Find the crystals. <laughs> Was that a thing? Uh, it's been a while since I played Zelda 2. You're finding something in Zelda 2. Maybe Link's just running around. Where's the crystals? <laughs> crystals! Ah! <laughs> I love the original Zelda, but I did play Ocarina of Time first. I had to go back and play that one. Zelda 2, I didn't really love. Yeah, I've never beaten Zelda 2. I don't think I've even come close to it, to be honest. I don't think anyone has. Yeah, has anyone ever beaten it? Have you Have you beaten it? Let us know in the comments. Don't lie. We'll know if you're lying. <laughs> yeah, if you tell us you beat it, we know you're lying. <laughs> <laughs> He's banging on with you like an invisible wall there. Yeah, what is he doing? Zelda just wakes up and he's over there. Ah, I'm gonna go back to sleep. This one is technically better because he's running around as Link, but it's still essentially the same vibe. Yeah, it Just really is. Zelda! 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 What is he doing there? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, there's no wall there. Just walk up. Remember in Zelda 2, the invisible wall? That was a big part of the game, but we didn't know because we didn't beat it. Oh, it's this one. Yeah, I this love one, baby. this one. This one's good. I wish I could do that. What? Oh my God, that move. I want that costume of the guy swinging the, the mace. I like that they put the spin move. Yeah. Yeah, they did the spin move. I never really thought about that in this commercial, but you couldn't spin. Which Zelda was this? It had to be the SNES. Yeah, you're right. This is the Super Nintendo. I was going to say, I th for a second, I thought it was the originals. When I found this one, I watched it like 10 times. I think the Dead or 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 Dead
Can I look up the lyrics really quick? Yeah, yeah. Deru deru. I think it was like coming soon or something, or better than ever or something. Uh, yeah, it's it's coming out, it's coming out, it's coming out. Ah. They say it like five times. You gotta drive home the point. Deru deru. Like and subscribe. Oh, I forgot how cool oh, the Ganon is. the giant is. Ganon. I forgot about that. They just tried so much harder back then. Yeah, that moves cool too, because anyone could do that, but it still looks cool. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I've never seen this. I don't think I have either. He looks kind of like a hobbit. Like, he doesn't look like Link to me. Is he supposed to be Link? I think so. He looks kind of like Samwise Gamgee or something. That's interesting. Uh, I've never, I've literally never seen that one. That wasn't that interesting, but it's still cool just seeing the effort they put in. Also, I told you I'd show you stuff you hadn't seen before. Ooh, I didn't think you could deliver, but uh, so far, so good. Maybe you're not the expert you thought you were. Are you telling me that because I Googled Zelda commercials uh, one time four years ago, I'm not an expert on it? All I did was Google so tell the commercials. <laughs> I have not compiled these at all. Oh, this one. This one, though. This one's a good one, yeah. It's Zelda. Game. You know the words? Zelda! And boy, da da da. Da, da, da. Yeah, I know. Him. I just love the effort they put in. Yeah, it's, it's almost a shame that there isn't better quality versions of some of these commercials. Well, the top comment on the actual youtube video for this on youtube where else would it be when like the new one was coming out because they remade it they were like nintendo please remake this commercial oh. how good would that have been even if they had animated it yeah it would have been so good hi rick mail here who rick mail here am i supposed to know them well this is early 90s so we were like three or whatever he looks like he could be famous what was with that last little gag at the end? He ran into the invisible wall from Zelda 2. <laughs> Whoa! That's the one he was bashing on? They brought it back. What a throwback. <laughs> Am I the only one kind of weirded out by how sensual that commercial for Zelda was? Maybe it's because I don't know who he is. He's like a famous saxophone player or something. He was in Harry Potter? Oh. He played Peeves, the poltergeist. Okay, you don't see that much of Peeves in the movie. Oh, wait, I know him. Drop Dead Fred. Oh, and the young ones. That's how I know him. Zelda from the very start I got the heart it's smart to play the part down with Zelda I love this with an overhead view cuz a man's got to do what a man's got to do so why stay on track collect the facts on the back cuz I always have a deck with Jack <laughs> I know the words it's so good dude yeah this one's very good it is really good like there's two elements to it here that I really like the way it's shot using these like props as projector templates essentially to like blast the images on the giant Game Boy. So clever, so cool. But the rap is actually good. Yeah, I'm always down for a good musical commercial or segment or whatever. Game Boy Color. Cheese. What? Whoa, no, 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 no. I never seen that. You didn't tell me you were gonna show me stuff I'd never seen before that I didn't want to have seen. I want my money back. Uh. I'm sorry. It popped up so fast, I was not expecting it. Willis thou? No one says Willis thou. Willis thou sink or swim? Willis thou finish? Or die trying? I mean, it looks epic. It makes me want to play the game. Willis thou saw? Oh, Willis thou <laughs> suck? <laughs> Oh my god, I was not expecting that epic troll. Why does that seem like a fake trailer made now? Like, it was so epic all the way up to Willis Thou Saw <laughs> or Willis Thou Suck. <laughs> oh god! That moon's so terrifying. No! Whoa, it's like shaking the room apart. This is a good commercial already. Yeah, it is. It's intense. Quick, go back in time! Play the song! Play the song! Zelda! Zelda! Oh, dude, the Japanese version of the box. I have it. Yo, you want to start showing off Japanese versions of things? Yeah. Look how good this is. I love the Japanese box for this. I, I know I have it. Hold on. Ah, I bet mine's in better condition. I bet it probably is. Okay, <laughs> let's see. Whose is more mint? Mine's in a plastic baggie. Yours is actually <laughs> in a little case. Well, no, I mean, it's the same case, though. No, I don't have a... You've got, like, a plastic, like, solid case. Oh, no, this is, this is cardboard. Oh. Well, in that case, I, mine's in a little baggie. <laughs> well, do you have... Show me because I might have it. Zelda's Adventure for the CDI? No, but... Top that. Top that. Do you have the original Zelda's on Famicom? What? <laughs> well... Uh, That's what I thought. Do you have Wind Waker, Japanese Wind Waker box from GameCube? I don't have the ones he just showed, so I was moving on. I don't know, peeps. 
Do I? Dang it! <laughs> I will actually admit defeat. It's you. I've seen your Zelda collection. It's better than mine. Do you have the original promo sealed Ocarina of Time that doesn't actually have a game in it? Just an exclusive poster that you can only get in this and I have no idea what it looks like because I've never opened it. Hold on. ebay.com. I don't have it yet. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I kind of want to keep comparing, but we should probably keep reacting. <laughs> <laughs> These Majora's Mask commercials are scary. That was actually freaky. I know, they're so dark. Great freeze frame. Putting on the masks always make me feel really uncomfortable in the game because Link legitimately seems to be in pain. So I would try really hard to avoid having to put them on because I felt bad. This one's interesting. They have all these cultures around the world coming together to marvel at Zelda. Or be afraid of it. Oh. It's Majora still. The world's ending. Okay. 72 hours. One hope. That's a lot of pressure for like 10 year old me. I gotta be honest. <laughs> Game Boy Color. That animation was interesting. I've never seen that either. I haven't seen most of these. I really thought I'd seen like most of the Zelda commercials, but apparently not. Oh, oh my God, that's creepier than anything we saw before with Majora's. Yeah, maybe topped only by the mouth guys. Oh, Wind Waker. I love this game so much. This is probably the Zelda I've played and finished the most. I think me as well, even though I still say Majora's Mask is my favorite, I probably played through Wind Waker the most. It's just so easy to pick up and go. I know. Wind Waker was also the first game I played that felt like an open world game. Yeah, it did. And even though every island, there wasn't some insane thing to do on every island, there was still enough reason to go to every one. And like, what's this island gonna be? I feel like so many people play it now and they're like, oh, these islands have nothing on them because they're so used to worlds being so dense and full. Back then, like going to a random island and even just finding a chest was yeah. like, oh yeah, I mm -hmm. found a chest, Zelda! Zelda! It was so good. <laughs> There's a terrible Wind Waker commercial. I assume it's gonna be in this video. It better be. Bring puppets back, Nintendo. I know. Uh, they're really good about bringing back things like that. I think they should. Remember when they did the puppets for the E3 presentation? Yeah, actually, yes. Yeah, they did bring it back then, I guess. This is the commercial that sucks. Why does it suck? Hold on. I'm holding. What is wrong with this commercial? I want, I want to see if you can pinpoint what I'm thinking. To save me. Do you have do you have a thought? You don't save Zelda in that one. That actually is true. That that is that is part of it, but that's not my thought. Like go like go back and look through these commercials. Look at all the shots they're using. I don't like that. I feel like I'm being quizzed by the Zelda master over here. <laughs> well, there's no right answer. It's just what I what my thoughts on it. Look at the whole theme of this versus the theme of, of Wind Waker. Well, yeah, it's got a very dark theme for sure, yeah. and it's not a dark game at all. Yeah, they pinpoint out only the dark shots. They look at all these dark shots. You want to know why I think that might be? What's that? Because think of what we've watched so far today, most of them were really dark commercials, and that was working for Nintendo. And Majora's Mask and that promotion must have really worked because they made so many of them that they probably made this really happy, light, bubbly Zelda game and then thought, we should probably throw in some dark commercials so it sells. <laughs> I bet that's what happened. Yeah, maybe something like that. Is the ocean gonna get views, though? <laughs> Do you know what this is, by the way? Are you familiar with this? The game they're playing? Yeah. No. I only recently even discovered this. What is it? I still don't completely know what it is. Oh. It's like some Tetra thing. Like a Tetra-based game? Yeah. Like, I literally only just recently discovered this. That is nuts. You send me a link to that later. I don't even remember where I had it. I think I saved it in a YouTube playlist for, like, video oh, ideas or something. Oh, the- what that- <laughs> Say what? What these kids are playing. Yeah. I thought you meant what the old men were playing. Oh, <laughs> no, no. I thought that was some Tetra board game. Dude, I wish. That would be so niche. That song when you're riding on the train, though. Pretty good. You got to admit that. I mean, Zelda music's always good. Oh, uh, yeah. Here's the song. Okay. All right, you can skip it. <laughs> <laughs> All those swords raining from the sky can't be good. Yeah, that's probably a lawsuit. That's probably bad. <laughs> I would not be happy about that. Well, actually, you get a free sword. Yeah, but you have to fix this, the roof on your apartment. But you get a free actual master sword, though. Now I'm thinking about it. Oh, it's a Skyward Sword commercial. That's actually pretty cool. I'm so stoked for Skyward Sword, dude. Skyward Sword HD. I know. I'm so excited to play it again. Yeah, me too. It's been a while. Are you going to miss waggling the sword around in the air like a madman? That's one of the most contentious things of all Zelda games is the motion controls 
Falls and Skyward Sword. Some people hate it. And then some people mean like, I liked it. I liked it. I thought it was kind of, I liked it. We're on the same page about so many things. I liked it too. Yeah. I actually thought it was really cool. There were different arguments. Some people said they just didn't like it. Okay, fair. That's subjective. Some people's like, it didn't work right. What do you mean it didn't work right? Did you have your thing set up? I mean, I never had problems with it. The motion plus definitely helped. Oh, you had to have the motion plus to play, right? Oh yeah, you did. Then what are yeah. they complaining about? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. See, it came in that box like that. I, I, I have to have that somewhere because I own the game, but I actually don't know where it is. I'm actually butthurt. Where is that? I, <laughs> I know I have that. I'm actually butthurt, he said. I am. Where is my, where's my Skyward Sword? Dude, it's okay. If you don't have it, it's fine. I mean. No, I swear I got it. I have it somewhere. I have the soundtrack. Extra mile, you know? I, I have to get it again. I think my brother stole it from me. Your dog ate it? Ah! <laughs> the CDI yeah. games, though. Do you have the CDI games? You're, yeah. You, you want me to get them? Because yes, I do. Damn it. I like how you're one step away from actually walking around your room going, Zelda! Zelda, where is Zelda? Zelda! Speaking of another Grid Zelda game, this game oh, is Oh, this one's good. fantastic. That's in my top five Zelda games of all time. It's definitely my favorite handheld Zelda. Yeah. Hey, it's that song again. The song is back. Why is that so catchy? Coming out soon. Coming out soon. It doesn't work in English. It's coming soon. Coming soon. At a certain point, all these game companies, not even just Nintendo, they're like, they feel so confident in the way their game looks, they just show the gameplay. But I, I like those old commercials where the graphics weren't so good, so they had to like get creative with what the commercial was going to look like. I know the commercials really quickly into like the last like five to ten years got really, what am I looking for? Commercial, really. Sorry, I like that I'm like, they got really professional, really commercial the last five, <laughs> 10 years. And then in 2015, <laughs> no! <laughs> Maybe not in Japan. I don't know. Yeah, Japan. They know how to have fun. Yeah, now we get boring, I think. Yeah, it, it gets less interesting over time. Yeah. What were your favorites? Oh, yeah. I think easily the guy banging on the wall and screaming Zelda became my favorite throughout the video. The screaming Zelda man. Yes. Zelda! I like ditter 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 ditter. That's in top five. Oh yeah, that's three. for sure. The puppets for Link's Awakening. Yes, the puppets were great. Yeah, I'll put the puppets up there. That's four. We have room for one more then. Oh wait, the actual number ones have to be the raps. Yeah, the down with Zelda from the very start. They're so good. Look at it, so it's smart to play the part. You down with Zelda. You know that too well. Did you see the latest Nintendo newsletter? Whoa, nice graphics. I'd like to get my hands on that game. It's a legend of Zelda and it's really rad. Our creatures were getting a pretty bad. Octoroks, Tech Techs, and Leavis too. But with your help, our hero pulls through. Yeah, go Link. Yeah, get Zelda. Get Zelda. Woo! Legend of Zelda. A never ending adventure. You for your Nintendo Entertainment. Your parents help you hook it up. The Legend of Zelda sold separate. Down with Zelda from the very start. I got the heart, it's smart to play the part. D -d Down with Zelda. Uh, a creeping through with an overhead view. Cause a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. So I stay on track, collect a fact. Never cut slack and I always watch my back for Jack. Uh, uh, D -d -d Down with Zelda, yeah. Uh, do not bend, I'm the man with the plan Cause the power's in my head and the power's in my hand Down with Zelda It's coming, it's coming, this adventure is gorgeous Soon you'll experience all this This one's a tough one, just like the classic Puzzle solving action with amazing graphics the switch, of course, so defeat demise using the Triforce. Get caught up without getting confused, and unlike Mario, it's not getting removed. Just kidding, Mario. You know we love you. 35 years of saving the princess, 35 years of making new friendships. From NES all the way to the Switch, 100 million souls out of ain't no niche. It's up to us, the fans, to celebrate. The courage to show why Zelda's great. So from players all across the land, Link, Zelda, even Tingle, we stand. Oh, and jokes aside, let's not forget. Because without Nintendo, we wouldn't have met. So, whomever, wherever, why ever, however, no better. Zelda forever. 
years of saving the princess 35 years of making new friendships From many yes all the way to the switch 100 million souls out there ain't no niche It's up to us Thanks for watching whatever this video was. Thanks for having me. Just like Peebs suggested earlier. Like and subscribe. But not only to me, but to Peebs, who has his own main channel, a side channel, a Twitch. It's all going on. I can't even keep up. There's links down below, though. I can't even keep up either, and I'm doing it. Oh, I have Twitch too, and I'm actually playing through Skyward Sword right now. So come hang out. Twitch.tv forward slash beat-em-ups. All right. Bye. Bye.